Alright guys, so it's pretty late at night and I'm very tired so I thought I'd play a nice relaxing game. This is called FTL, Faster Than Light, and uh, I learned about it from Total Biscuit a while ago. Just got to grab my microphone, I'm just trying to position it in a nice position. Um, I figured this would be a really good game for a nice relaxing video. So if, um, I know that when I watch videos it's usually when I'm trying to fall asleep. So I watch things where people don't tend to shout and stuff. Um, because otherwise I'm just about to drop off and then someone goes, Oh my god! And I wake up. So yeah, hopefully this will be a video that appeals to you guys. And the music in this game is amazing and it makes me happy. So uh, let's start this game. This game is a 2D top down. Uh, the graphics aren't impressive in the slightest, but it's pretty much all about roleplay. And basically, it's a game about dying again and again and again. So uh, let's rename our ship. I'm going to call this the uh, the Jamzy Ship. Jamzy Ship? Jamzy Mobile. Definitely the best name ever. And Fen. Fen, we're going to call him, uh, it's going to be James Boy, that's going to be me. So uh, I'm going to try and keep him alive as good as I can. Oh, I can actually change my skin. Oh, I can change him between male and female. I'm going to call this guy Ginger Kid Jack. Ginger Kid Jack. And um, of course, it's going to be a woman. And this person I'm going to call um, Loser. And he should be the person who we sacrifice because um, you've got to have someone you sacrifice because someone's bound to die. And they would also be a woman because I'd feel bad about uh, I'd feel bad about killing a guy. No, no, I'd feel bad about killing a woman. I should definitely choose a guy. Yeah. Um, obviously, I can't choose any layouts and I can't choose any other weapons or anything like that. So basically, we're just going to go on easy. But first, I must be right back. I have returned from my voyage to begin a new voyage into the land of whatever this world is. So basically, this is my ship. So it's my ship. These are my crew members. We have here, this is Ginger Kid Jack. Uh, we're going to send him to the weapons. And this is Loser. And fuck him. So we're going to send him to the. Uh, to that. Maybe to the shields, actually. I'm going to send him to the shields. Um, <clears throat> if you know how to play this game, then watching this is going to be infuriating because I don't know what I'm doing. Me. <laughs> Whatever. Um, basically, you put power into the systems and stuff. So I can power up my weapons like that. Which uses up all my power, or I can put my power into the engines, but uh, I think I'll leave my weapons on and start jumping. So basically you jump from place to place, and every time you jump to a place, something terrible happens. Or good. Yeah, something happens, basically. So this is the first place, and we've come across an enemy ship. This is an automated message. Res resisting our takeover is pointless. Prepare to die. And uh, yeah, so that's great. So we're going to die, which is always a good thing. So we've got this missile, which we can use to take out their shields. And I'm going to fire a burst laser at their weapons. And hopefully, if all goes well, we'll be able to just poon them in one shot, basically. Now, okay, so we've taken damage to the medical base. I'm just going to go send the guy to repair that. In fact, I'm going to send two guys to repair that, because we've also got some fire going on. And we've taken out both their weapons and their shields. So they can't do anything. So basically, I can just go and, you know, save the world and stuff. Uh, any time now will be good. Okay. Obviously, I need to go back to the helm because I'm the most important person here. There we go, always go. Let these guys heal us up heal up first. Come on, there we go, right. Send them all back. No, actually, you you go over there. Who are you? Are you the loser? You should be the loser. Oh, Jinjika Jack's back there. That's good. As long as Jack isn't in a good position, I don't mind. Um, right, so yeah, basically, we've. Oh, they're repairing. Okay, well, I should probably like shoot them then. Kill them. There we go. Ships destroyed. So you have a limited amount of missiles and stuff, but I just picked up some missiles and fuel and scrap. Scrap is used for um, scrapping, um, <laughs> for buying stuff at the store. And there's a store here, so going to the store would be a good idea. Let's do that. Ah, we've arrived. Yeah, whatever. Right, okay, so this is the store. I can buy some stuff. I'm going to buy some missiles and some fuel. Um, I've already got quite a lot of stuff, so that's not really important. I can cloak, um, but this is all quite expensive, and I just spent most of my money. So I'm going to just fix myself up to full, and then I'm just going to buy a few more missiles, because it's got plenty of fuel. Mm, yeah, there we go. And then we're going to move on. So I'm going to go over here. Especially well-armed pirate ship approaches you. Hmm, well-armed, eh? 
Ah, I don't want to lose a person. Oh, but he does say he's well armed. I could die from this. But I'm going to kill him because I do not accept. No, I will not die. You bastards. You're probably going to get absolutely raped right now. Ha! Take one of our slaves as a tribute. Hmm. New crew member. Do I want a new crew member? See, I'm not going to get many opportunities to get a new crew member. I'll do it. Fine, bugger off you foon fools. That yeah, basically just raped him. And it said he was well armoured. Okay, so we've got a new person. His name is Huts. And we will send him to the engine room. Yo, bitch. And we shall travel to a new place. Oh, a distress beacon. Let's go there. Whoosh. Pirate ship. There was a trap. Kill him. Okay, Artemis on their shields, burst laser on their weapons. Fire and ready. Oh, it's trying to escape. Quick, right, take out its FTL drives, which is its engines, basically. So we're going to target its engines so that it can't get away. And we kill them. Ha ha! Ah, these people are dying easily. This is all good. This is going good. Uh, well, see now this is um, the enemies. They move across the screen, and they kill you. So basically, I'm going to do a little tour. I'm not, I'm not going to move out of this sector until they're basically upon us. Higher than Mercury. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to hire this mercenary scout. To, uh, I'm going to make him s great. So I got that guy to scout the sector for me, and he's a uh, possible ship detected. Possible ship detected, possible ship detected. So basically going here is not going to yield a ship. So hopefully it will yield something good. Board the station and look for survivors. Ah, we've got some scrap, but nothing useful. So we know there's going to be enemy ships over here. Ah, I might as well go to one of them. It's not going to... Unless he's very good, we're not going to get completely owned. Fire up the weapons. Right, fire the Artemis at the shields and the burst laser at the weapons. That tends to be the kind of go-to thing. Just take out his shields and then clean his weaponry. There we are, taking out both already. Easy on this game is really quite easy. Um, and then you can just fire the burst laser. I mean, I don't really need the Artemis. That's fine. Um, two missiles, one drone part and scrap. I will not accept your surrender. I screw you. I will kill you. I reckon I can get more just by killing this guy. He's gonna shoot at me. Look at him. It's crazy. Oh, you dead! You dead! There you are. I didn't really get all that much, but it's not the end of the world. We should get over it. Okay, let's move uh, to here, and then we'll go to the exit. We. Uh, I'm going to explore the asteroid field. We've got nothing of interest. Excellent. Right, let's get out of here then. To the exit. Oh, I've got some stuff. That's good. Right, so to the next sector. Now, this is where we get to choose which kind of path we'd like to take. Uh, we get to con choose which... Uh, sectors we'd like to go through now there's uh, two factions as far as i'm aware rock and this either other guys and being with them gives you like stuff and like new ships and stuff being in a pirate controlled sector not probably the best idea i'm gonna go with the rock sector because their ship looks pretty well less it's not unheard that they have a peaceful journey through their lands but don't count on it Ooh, scary i have a lot of crew members how did I get five? I thought I had four. Hmm. That's a pretty good start. I forgot here. Ship refueling station in station. We can purchase fuel here. Do we want lots of fuel? Yeah, why not? I really don't want to run out of fuel. That would suck. Now we've got another person here. I'm going to stick him into... So now these are subsystems. 
And it didn't really matter. I mean, I didn't actually need this person. <laughs> I mean, he would help me with like fighting off people, but I don't really need him. I don't actually remember where I got him from. Which is a bit weird. Oh well, let's move on. There's a distress beacon. They're generally a good idea to go to. More interesting than the other beacons anyway, so. <laughs> We're being overrun by some strange of giant alien spiders. <laughs> Send the crew help immediately. <laughs> giant alien spiders are no joke. That's true, I don't like spiders, so I'm gonna go help them. Oh no. Oh good, we, we seem to be okay. Phew, I thought I was going to lose a crew member there. That could have been awful. Let us move. Uh, well, let's do a little loop. We'll go back around. Like that. A motley collection of rock ships is selected. Ooh. Ooh. Right, let's kill them. Gonna power up my burst laser, my Artemis. Be right back. And poon their shields. And their weapons, of course. Let's go. Oh yeah, you can pause as well, I forgot to mention that. That's quite an important part of the game actually pausing, but I kind of forget to do it quite often. Right, so their shields and things are both injured, but not dead. Bit of a shame there. I'm just going to do exactly the same thing again, because this seems to be the best opportunity way of doing things. And they're dead. Easy. Easy. Yes. They left some stuff. Not an amazing amount, but we'll live. Detect signs of a battle. There's nothing around. I don't think I'm actually going to be able to bridge that gap. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go there, 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 then there. Because I think I'll have plenty of time to do that. In fact, I could probably go further, but never mind. Well known slave trader. Slave trader. Hmm. I don't need another crew member at all, so I'm gonna I'm gonna attack him because he is scum and I hate him. Now we, he has a drone. Um, taking out his drone could be a good idea, but I need to get through his shields first. So I think that'd be a good idea. Oh, our helm is taking damage. Oh, they surrender. No, I don't need a slave. Fuck you. All right, let's take out his shields. Make sure those shields are completely down. In fact, no, we'll take out his weapons because oh shit. Okay, so what he's done is he's taken out my um. Oh no, we're losing. Oh no, All right, we're losing stuff. Quick, repair. You get in there. You get in there. So yeah, what taking any surveillance systems means that you basically can't see what the hell is going on, and we're actually losing oxygen in this room because uh, there we are. Everything's getting better now. So everyone go back to their respective rooms. Who forgot here? This is loser in the medical bay, being useless because he's yeah a loser. Ginger kid in the weapons. Hurts over there. And Jamsy Boy. Oh, you're a bit injured there, Jamsy Boy. What are you doing? Being injured. How dare you? Repair yourself. You're the most important person we have, Bureau. I have returned again. Apparently, I can't get a break in this house, even late at night. My parents want to bug me. God, fuck everything. Um, so that's still miles away, so I'm going to go to this distress beacon, and I think I'll be able to make it back like that. Hopefully. If I don't, then I'm screwed. But we should be fine. You find the source of a nearby distress call, the small research station. There's a small laboratory firing out controllers threatening to destroy the station. Their fire suppression system is not responding. So now if I save them, they're probably just going to give me a crew member. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to send my crew in. Oh, we've got some scrap. Cool. Great. Everything seems to be going quite well this this game. So I think I've already been to this station. Oh no, this is a fire station. This is bad. Things catch fire on this one. But we have got a spare guy who can run around doing stuff, so that's good. Um Alright, so let's take out this this bastard here. Who seems to be wanting to to, to bugger us up. And fire. Alright, we're taking out his weapons, that's good. Oh, we're gonna really need this. Okay, we're gonna repair that as quickly as we can because then um, shit's gonna start catching fire. Oh dear, right, okay, we've got all our systems back online, so that's all good. Um, right, we're gonna fire our Artemis. Oh shit, things are going really badly here. 
Oh shit, we're gonna lose a crew member. No, no, run, 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 run. You moron. Oh god, things are going bad, things are going bad. Where's my other crew members? What are they doing? What are you doing, you morons? Right. Frickin' repair our ship. Yeah, we've lost our weapon systems, um, because this room is obviously on fire. Right, you get in there, you get in there. Oh god, this is bad, we really need to get out of here. Alright, we destroyed their ship, so now all we're waiting for is for everything to be back online. Oh god, this is bad, this is really bad. Get out of there. Oh god, we're gonna lose people. Alright, everyone get through there. Alright, you guys repair that. You're not taking more damage, are you? Oh shit, you are as well. Oh god, we're, we're losing shit. Badly. Right, that's repaired. Get in there. Put out of the fire in there. Oh shit, no, no. We're gonna lose people. We're, we're Things are going bad. We could die. We could die right now. Because of the stupid flames and stuff. Oh god, there's fires in there as well. This is ridiculous. Why Why are we not going? No, okay, right. No, oh no, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. Right, we need to get out of here. Oh, oh, we've got, we've got FTL. We've got FTL. Get the fuck out now. Okay, things just got really bad really quick. Right, we need to deal with this. Everyone get in there. Come on, go, 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 go. Get in the medical bay. Right, heal yourselves. You get out of there, get into there. Right, when you're all nicely prepared, you're going to get in there. Come on, put out the fire. Come on. Come on. You can do this. I believe in you. Okay, you get in there. No, not you. You're going to die. In fact, you just run all the way through. Just repair yourself. Don't die. Oh, they're all dying. They're all dying. They're all going to die. They're all going to die. We've lost someone. No, he just, he's just going to die. He died. Okay, that was my fault. I sent him into the room. But no, this is bad. Right, oh, oh god, this is so bad. I think, yeah, we're dead, we're dead, there's too many fires. I'm, all my men are dying. We're, de we're dead. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Even with five people, one solar flare, and we were all dead. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Anyway, that was Fast and Light. Uh, you can get that from the Fast and Light website, and you can redeem it on Steam, so you can download it through Steam, which is nice. I like that. It was eleven euros. It was about five pounds something in the UK, obviously. So you can get that, and it's really fun for roleplay and stuff. I'm not sure how much I'll actually end up playing this, but if you guys really want it again, then next time I'm this tired, I will definitely do another video. So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.